Hey man, what to do, YouTube? It's your boy, so you know, coming at you with another banger, man. So, look, in this video, bro, I'm coming at y'all with the best new badge glitch on NBA 2K21. Look, bro, 2K21 just dropped, bro, and I know y'all need y'all badges. So, look, I'm here and I got y'all, boys. You know, feel me? Disclaimer, this is not my footage. This is JJ's 2K, you know what I'm saying? I'll leave the link to him down below, you feel me? Bro, please drop a like and sub, but you know what I'm saying? Help your boy out. I'm trying to hit 1K, you know what I'm saying? Without further ado, let's get straight to the video, man. I'm out. Get to whenever you guys can join a college, all right? This is only going to work in college if you guys are still in high school and or in my career. Sorry, it's not going to work. So either make a new player and just do it because, listen, whenever it comes out on next gen, you will not be able to carry over your players. So just know that. So at least watch the video, know how to do the glitch, and then you guys will be golden. So this only works in the second game of college. I do not know why. It does not work in the first game. But the moment you do hop into your second game, it's going to be very simple and very easy. Just listen to me, alright? So what we're going to want to do is ball the absolute heck out. So have your best game possible on your new player. For example, there's 38 points right now. I, the, the grade does not matter, okay? But regardless, whenever it goes below 30 seconds, this is when you guys are just going to want to get a dead ball foul. And then once you do that, you're just going to save and quit my career. Now what this does, if you guys don't know what happens with this, for some reason this glitch still works in college, right? You guys are going to realize that it looks similar to another glitch with the VC glitch, but this still works. So you guys are going to obviously close your application, load back into your NBA 2K21 new player. So in this case, we're going to load back into the college save file. Whenever you save and quit, what that basically does is it creates a save point so you guys can keep going back to. And that is what we want. So now you guys are going to see, again. There's what, 25 seconds left on the clock. We're just gonna let the clock end, okay? So we're not gonna wanna do anything. You guys see here, obviously there was a steal. You guys don't need to do that. Once you guys get below 30 seconds and you save your my career and quit, it is as simple as that just to set it up. And assuming you guys did well enough to even make this worth your time, you're gonna get crazy badge progress. And this is gonna set you up to get an amazing amount of badges. Currently, for me, in my pure sharp, within like, I think, Maybe like three hours, I have 19 shooting badges currently, which is insane. If you guys know anything about badge grinding, 19 badges for one like specific pie chart is insane. Like within three hours, this is crazy. This is guaranteed to get all your badges within a day, less than a day to be honest. But I will say this, let me also say this. You can do this game eight times per day. And so what I've heard actually, I'm not gonna lie to you, I'm pretty sure you guys can do the third college game the same way, but I never got to test it. I do know the second game works, okay? But I know for a fact you guys can do the second game eight times within a day's period. So if you guys do really good, and let's say you get two badges to your shooting in one game, right? You get 20,000 to shooting. You do it eight times, you can get a total of 16 badges per day, which is pretty crazy, bro. Not gonna lie to you. And you guys are gonna see, keep track of this badge progress and the attribute progress. As you guys are gonna see, this is a crucial part. So once all of this ends, once you get all your badge progress, your VC, etc., we're going to do a very simple thing. And once it all loads, we are just going to close our application, okay? So once you close your application, you're just going to hop back in NBA 2K21. And if you guys did it right, we should load directly back into the 25 seconds into the college game. And then from there, we're just going to keep repeating the same process over and over again. And you guys understand the point of this glitch. We are going to get max badge progress in little to no time. So I'm going to say it again, like I've said in many videos in the past. The quicker you guys watch these videos and the quicker you guys do the glitches, the better off you're going to be. You get no advantage to watch this a week later. And this is why I recommend subscribing to me. Because things like this, they get patched so quick. So if you're going to subscribe, let me just say, you guys might as well turn on post notifications because it's kind of useless just to subscribe because it's not going to notify you whenever these glitches come out. Not going to cap to you. So do that information as you please. I'm not going to ask you to, but I'm just saying for your sake, you're just better off doing it. Again, it's free, but again, I'm not going to beg you. I, it does not matter that much, bro. I'm not going to cap to you. But if you do enjoy my content, hey, you know what? You can always press the button. But again, as you guys are going to see, this is the second time this game is going to end. And if you guys track the attribute progress and the badge progress the first time, you guys are going to realize that things have changed, okay? So this time I got an attribute upgrade and as well as more to my finishing, more to my badges, and... It's basically that simple. You guys have realized how quick and how the badges have changed. They multiply now. So listen, the progress is even better now. <laughs> so if you guys want to keep repeating the same process, we're just going to do it over and over again up to about eight times. Now, let me just say this. If you guys get a zero badge progress game, you are not in trouble. So what you guys are just going to want to do, 
I'm not going to show it, but I know what it, it has happened in the past with other badge glitches. It is as simple as going to the NBA in this case, and then just simming the first season. And if that doesn't work, go to the neighborhood, play a park game, or anything that revolves around online play with your My Career character, and that should fix it. If that doesn't fix it, let's say that doesn't fix it, just comment down below, and I know a couple other ways, but in my cases, whenever I've seen you get zero badge progress, that has been the fixer. So hopefully that helps because I know there's a lot of questions revolving around that, but that should fix your issues if you do have zero batch progress. Now again, let me also say this, if you guys are asking questions on how to get to this game quicker, all you gotta do is just foul out of your games and then just go straight to college. Now again, for the third time, just to see the batch progress, we are gonna get even more progress. You guys are gonna see 22,000 here, 18 to finishing in this case. I get two badges to finishing, and then shooting is not that good because you know, didn't try to go for shooting in this gameplay but you guys understand the point all right you guys have seen three gameplays of the same game coming in at 25 seconds and you're seeing the badge progress go up every single game the badge progress itself multiplying and the attribute progress tripling i think at this point it's up to 24,000. i'm going to show you guys one more time just to ensure you guys realize one that it's that it works more than three times and two just to be honest because i want to make sure you guys fully understand what to do it's a, it's a pretty simple easy concept but again um some people learn better just by watching so the more you see it the more easier it'll be um don't mind getting fouled i tried speeding it up as much as possible but again there's still 25 seconds left you're gonna keep loading into the same game do it about eight times okay I, honestly probably about six just to be safe and then come back in like 24 hours because i'm gonna assume this isn't your main build right and that is probably the best part about this glitch. You guys can have a secondary build that you can just keep grounding the badges, get your max badges in like a day's time, and then you're set. You don't even gotta use them until you want to. It's really that easy. Now, unfortunately, like I said, I apologize for it not being like a main badge glitch for your main build. But listen, hey, stay tuned. I'm sure something will end up coming up on my channel. So don't worry about that. But as you guys see, there's six seconds left in the game and they take forever i know it's so annoying but once i inbound the ball you guys are going to see that i should get more than 24,000 of my attributes and more finishing badges because that is what it focused on in this game so as you guys see here 30,000 your points two almost three badges to your finishing and then there's more badge progress to